You're on. Oh, hey. Uh, April Morrow just taught a West Coast swing dance lesson. Um, Irene here helped assist. Um, we went over one pattern. We worked on one pattern for an, um, an hour. It was a hard pattern. So I'm really going to break it down for you here and try to make it easier so that when you see this, you can break it down into the components and uh, of two beats of music and try to get better at it. Um, so, simple setup. Right? I just took her for a right side pass. One, two, cut her back, three, four. And if I want to go five and six, I can, or I can call that good and just do one, two, three, a four. One, two, three, a four, and be ready to go. So it's really up to you, leads, how many beats you do there for the setup. That's just an easy setup. What was hard was the telemark turn. All right, so let's break it down. Every two beats of music, what are we doing? We're walking her out on count one, so make sure you don't do anything funky with your connection back over here. Right? You don't need this hand. We had you just drop it in class, because that's not where the lead is coming from. We want to get the lady to pay attention to her connection point right here. We're also used to leading from the hand. All right, so I'm going to have her walk out on one. On count two, I'm going to take my frame, and I'm gonna pull it into my body and then I'm gonna push my elbow out towards the lady so that her center is prepped out so that she now knows she's gonna do an inside turn. And as I do that, I phase her because if I don't, it feels uh, awkward, right? I'm pulling away from myself. So I just kind of rotate in and send my energy and connect to the lady right here. That also, reps my body to now shoot in and do my turn to the left so it's kind of like I'm prepping away now to uh, step into my turn right there. So again can we back up Irene so without stopping this time counts one two is a walk out and then the prep. One prep or two and look at her. All right good so now three of four I'm going to actually place her on count three and let her step before I take my left foot directly underneath of her center and then pull my energy out and away from her as I rotate my body away from her. I will send the lady around me, she'll pull her feet together and then walk out on the right foot for count four. That's a telemark turn. Here we go. One, two, three, pull it together. She walks out on her right foot for four. Now I'm going to send her through for five, six. Five, six, seven, up, eight. Let's do that again. And one, two, three, up, four. Don't need this hand. One, two, three, up, four. Five, six, seven, up, eight. So I'm going to have Irene lead me. All right. So I want to show you count four. I want to stop on count four. All right. So here we go. Ready? And one, she cuts me out. Two, I go around. Three, pull my feet together and walk out onto the right foot for count four. Five, six, seven, up, eight. Now that's a traditional telemark turn, ladies, but this is West Coast swing. So, I really leave me again. So I'll her probably do it a couple of different ways too. I just want to point out the differences. Ready? And one, she preps me two. Three, I hang back and walk out on my left foot. Why? Because I just make a weight change on it and so I can. Because I get to choose my rhythm. Da -da 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 Boom. <laughs> right? So we get to make that up right there, ladies. I'm only trying to show you the traditional West Coast swing thing that you pull your feet together. You get to pick which step you uh, step out on. It really all depends how you're playing within the partnership right there. So um, can I have you lead me all the way through it without stopping? Ready? And one, two, three, up, four, five, up, six, one, two, three, up, four, five, six, seven, up, eight. And then when we get really, really good at that lead, we can double it up. One, two, three, uh, four, five, six. I won't do too many because I just don't want to whirl her around and do too many turns right there. It's for her. <laughs> so, um, let's see. Any other points on that that we did? Um, the count. Oh, the question came up about can I extend that? Of course you can, and that's basically what we just did by doing that. That was your question on that. Yeah, so you keep going and making it a 10 or a 12 count. Thank you. Thank you.